Welcome back, everyone, to the next installment of Fatal Frame 2. We just ran around chasing the Crimson Kimono Girl from her hiding place, and we actually got into a fight with her. Amusingly enough, she was actually kind of a pushover. But we've been looking around the Tachibana house because we have finally gotten there. Took freaking forever. Now that we've done that, I believe the last thing we got was a diary. Crimson Diary 1. That's what we got. Itsuki, help me. I can't get out of the closet. We remember this, right? Well, now, we want to go back to the second floor. Ah. Sorry, I, I keep forgetting. On my parallel playthrough, I'm playing with 2D controls. So I keep pressing down, assuming I'll go down, and all I'm doing is turning around. Now, I'm going to want to go to the row of tatami rooms. West... Should be in there, I think. Honestly, I don't know how I'm supposed to figure this out. I guess closet, that's my hint. Hey, the room's not in black and white. Isn't that refreshing? So I'm gonna go that way. No side to freak me out. Wow, look at that. Can I look at this? No. Oh, oh, what a coincidence. I met Yai and Sai. The ceremony master says they will be the shrine maidens in the next ceremony. I asked them about Mutsuki, but they would not answer. The last letter from Itsuki said to come for Sai and Yai in the day of the ceremony. I wonder if he was trying to help Yai and Sai escape from the village. Spoiler alert, he was. This is the right way, right? Yeah, I kind of have to go a roundabout way. All right, all right. So she should be somewhere over here. In the closet. And she's staring right at me again! Oh, she left pretty quickly, didn't she? Oh, hello. Sorry, the thing snapped me out of the camera mode because the door shut. Oh no. Okay, that was close. She's good, I'll give her that. Oh, she's right there. Do it. Ooh, in the face! That, that's gotta do it. <laughs> you know what? Oh, I don't have it. Camera. Equip. Instead of that stupid slow function, I will equip. Zero. Not exactly powered up, though. Although, I can power it up. Ah, I don't have spirit orbs. Well, I'll finish blast. I guess at this point, there's no use in equipping zero. I'll just I'll just stick with blast for now. Whoa, hello. I just used a regular shot for the third one. As you can see the points you can get are ridiculous. Oh come on. I gotta wait for one more. Ah, I missed. Okay. Ooh, caught that one just in time. Hiding in the freaking drawer, that's cheating. Now, what I want to know is what the actual point was to beating her. Okay, I want to simply go back. I'm sure I'll get something for this. Alright, 
I always get so easily disoriented, especially in this little set of rooms with a bunch of doors everywhere. This place is not my forte, I gotta admit. Hold on, did you see that in the camera angle? Yeah, it's a glowy item. Tricky, tricky. Oh, good thing I got that too. Type 90, I haven't even had a use for that yet. You know that's going to be crazy. Staircase hallway. And I want to head back downstairs. All right. Save after thoroughly trouncing that ghost. Bingo! Okay. I really don't know how I'm supposed to figure out where to go other than guessing and checking. That would just make for a boring LP. Uh, oh, come that's not fair. Ah, damn 3D controls, I couldn't even turn around. That's the one weakness. Oh well, now now I know I got a follower. Assuming she went this way, wasn't she just past Mayu's cell? I guess that's in there, right? Okay. Um. Hmm. Twins room. Oh, duh, she must have been running down that one hallway that I haven't explored yet. Yeah, that makes more sense. Now I can actually see what's going on. There's all sorts of rooms. Hey! Ooh, four! Because of Yai, Itsuki has been taken away somewhere. How come? Itsuki did nothing to her. It's all her fault for running away. I think Sai might start being pissed right about now. Old bowls and teacups. Oh, cool. A sword? Can I take it? When you try lifting it, you find it's really heavy. Who could swing this thing? Your yeah, swords really are surprisingly heavy. Even katanas. You see them in anime, they're like whipping those things around. They're way heavier than you think. A picture on the cabinet door. It doesn't look like there's anything inside. You sure a ghost doesn't come out of that thing? Uh, is that it? Okay, free items. I'm not about to complain. I haven't touched this place in the house yet. Ugh. I don't like these curtains at all. Pots of the large vessels, none of them look useful. I don't like being in here. Nothing in the cabinet. Ooh! More movies! Tinder and charcoal. Can't even investigate that. Now, where am I going? I guess I might as well keep exploring, right? I'll get to the projector room a little bit later. I am curious about this film reel 5. What? Oh, hey! Come on, try to jump me, see what happens. Oh, man, such distortion. Where the hell is she? Ah, oh, I deserve that. She actually hurts. <laughs> I love how I just push her down. She's attacking me and still I just knock her on her ass. Do it. Do it. 
Ah, I missed my opportunity. Oh well. We're good. Yes, yeah, stay down. Oh, it's right here. Yikes. Oosh! There we go. Oh no, I was a little late. That's okay. Where the hell is she? Woo! She's good. That startled me. I didn't think she'd attack twice in a row. I'll just kill her. Screw this. Oh, I hear the bell ring again. Is that a good sign? Nothing in here. Oh, that startled me. Ah, I can't navigate properly. Is there anything else I can do over here? Guess just walk down. Alright, just checking. Boards nailed to the window. Even if it were laid outside, the light probably couldn't get in. Hmm. Old sandals. Okay. Lots of old sandals. Oh, an urn. Sweet. Huh? Oh, cutscene, hey. With the view like this, you know I'm about to get into a fight. Oh! Who the hell are you? Ugh. Oh no, it's cannon fodder. Whatever, ever, ever shall I do? Other than, you know, be bored fighting these guys. I will heal a little bit, though. The one reason that guy hit me is because I just didn't see it coming at all. These guys are smucks. Look at that. This is going to be a freaking joke. Look at this little... This is just pathetic. Whoa! That really is a cool effect when they go through each other. Oh, I didn't get much time to see that one. Swing his stupid scythe. I'm getting ready to just take a picture. Just screw this. Wait for it. Oh! That, uh, what, what did he like lose frames of animation when he swung? Screw you, I'm kicking your ass! Little whims at the beginning of the game. Oh, piss off! Yeah, you like me now. Hide behind the walls. Come on, swing it, you loser. Swing it. Slick blast. Yeah. Thousand points, losers. What you got for me? What you got for me? Swing it, you loser. I'm aware it was a fatal frame moment. I didn't know. Oh, I got all three of you little losers? Come on. Triple shot? Double shot. I could do better. Come on, you idiots. Why don't you swing something? How close do I have to get for you losers to try something? Fine. Triple shot. These guys have a lot of health. I gotta say, I'm getting ready to switch film on these guys. Blast! Oh, wow. <laughs> you just heard that impact. Come on, get back up. These idiots aren't swinging because they're in the way of each other. It's pathetic. What are they afraid they're going to do? Hate each other? Core shot. Just a double shot? How would you do better than double? I really should probably just switch my film to- Whoa! The torch guy actually did some- No, it's a single guy. Ow! I should probably switch my film type. I'll do it next time. I'm a little late now. It is too late for me, my son. I'm going to enjoy killing that worthless torchbearer. What's he ever done? Other than, you know, watch. It 
Did I kill any of these losers yet? I'll kill the torch guy just because he's useless. And he's a distraction. Oh, he's gonna hit me. Nope! Piss off. These guys can take a hit, I gotta say. It's kind of exhilarating fighting these guys again. It's been a long time and they've powered up. Do it. Hit me hard, come on. Do something. Anything, you schmucks. Do I have to hurt myself for you? Core shot. Core shot. Didn't I kill you yet? Gotcha. You and me, sickle man. Oh yeah, now you're walking forward. Aren't ya? Aren't ya? Man, this is one pathetic fight. And I got hit a disgraceful number of times, too. Eh, yeah, piss off. Now give me rewards. Nothing, I hate you. Now about that door. It shut fast and there are thick boards nailed over it. <sighs> Fine. Fine, fine. Well, that didn't do anything for me, did it? Why even bother with all that? Whoa, look at this place. Can't take it. Can't go further. Good to know that it's there, though. I guess really the point of this room was just to fight that crimson kimono again. Now where are we going? I guess I gotta go back until I find something relevant. Oop, I heard the bell. I heard the bell. Actually, I could I could stand for a save. There we go. I guess the real hint is to simply follow the sound of the bell. Now, just because I know, I'm going upstairs. Again, otherwise you'd just be watching me wander forever. And in Fatal Frame, that's not very good. Now, let's see. I'm going to want to hit the sliding screen room. Bingo. Uh, do I need to go up a different staircase? I'll, I'll try going around this way. Apparently, I haven't done that. Uh, what are they trying to keep from getting in? Is this just a dead end hallway? Oh, no, I can cross over. This is good. Fine, for exploration's sake, yay, I'm happy I did that. Bingo, this is what I want. I thought I'd have to go down and around and then back up, that'd be just annoying. Okay, sliding screen room. That is simply around. That's easy. Even I can handle that. Aha! Uh -huh. What is it not in there? Fine. Hmm? 
Oh, come on, I can hear her so clearly. Oh, because I'm in the damn storeroom. She's just around the corner. All right, all right. What? Um. How how do I leave? Um. Oh, that's creepy. That's freaking Silent Hill 2 treatment right there. That's really effective. Well done, Fatal Frame 2. You got me good. Oh, that's the way it's done. Just screw with my head a little bit. I like that kind of scare. And now I've unlocked more of the house. Alright. Now where's the girl? A small desk, old papers and books. A lot of books. Closet? Bingo. Let's go. The fourth battle. Eh, again, because I walked away from the closet, it snaps me out of it. Oh, come on, man. I want to get a fatal frame on you. Oh, that'll do it. That'll do it. Core shot, baby. Probably won't get the blast off. Yeah, no. Still, it's like half her health. Nope, chump change. I don't need this. Whoa. No, not tolerating that. Wow, that just killed her. That's ridiculous. Gotcha. Alright, now the last thing I want to do, I think it's the last one, is I want to head to the Deluxe Tatami room on the bottom floor. I guess the real hint is just try to remember where the boxes are, but th that's kind of hard. Come on. Okay, just go down that way. Sweet, I'll do that. Back around. And we're on the first floor. Bingo. Now, where's the deluxe tatami room? I know it's not too far. Oh, the projector room. Sure, while I'm right here. Do I get the save point while I'm at it? There's the angle I want. Alright, guys, it's movie sign! Ah! Is that the Osaka house? Like the dirt hallway? It might just be. Ooh, ghost. Interesting, they were able to record ghosts. Yeah, it looks like the Osaka house, alright. Who knows, maybe there was Itsuki. Whoa, what the hell? Ugh, someone got killed. Well, you know what? It's not gonna be us. We're too good for that. Deluxe to Tommy Room, how far? Okay, I will go straight forward. And just so I don't screw myself up, I will just take a very brief detour into this very next room, save, and then go about my business. Where we started the chapter. Sigh. Alright, good. Back to business.
Okay, now, the Lux Tommy room, I think we just gotta go around, not too hard, around the hallway of contrasts, through the twins room. Okay, easy enough. Twins room is right here. Other side. Oh, I guess it's this side. Man, I'm bad at this. Oh, it's just a stone mirror. That's right, I don't need that. Moving on! Okay, I think we might even be in the proper hallway. Yes. So it's just straight ahead, easy. This ought to be the last encounter. There's a closet, alright. Oh. So they must be jamming it from the inside. Oh my god. Oh, don't crawl, man. That's freaking Ringo. I don't need that. Where the hell are you? I was spinning like I'm having a freaking seizure and like. Wow, where the hell are you? Uh. Damn. Come on. Damn. No. Crap. Nice try. Nice try, you brat. Oh, she's right there. Come on, sucker. Yeah, cry a little more. I screwed up that combo, but that's really okay. She's quick, but I'm better. Ah. Uh... Ah, false alarm. Come on, come on, this is what you want. Are you kidding me? Oh, come on. Oh, she was getting up. I don't want that. In the wall. Come on. She has a lot more health this time around, it seems. Do it. Do it. Get over here. Wimp. No. What's the matter? Too quick for you? That probably didn't hit. Yeah, no. I'm doing alright. I would like a little more uh, Type 14 film, though. Fool! That didn't hit. No way. Wow, that took off like most of her health before. Looks like the crying still worked. Jeez, that's creepy as hell. That's freaking creepy. That's hard to see. Ha ha ha. Oh, I am pro. You like that? You like that freaking shots in the dark? And stay out. Back my brother. Oh, the bell key. Crystal, okay. No spirit orb. All of a sudden I actually care about spirit orbs and I'm not getting them. Anything else? No. Ugh. 
poor kid. What a miserable existence. Also... New memo. Chitose Tachibana was Itsuki and Mutsuki's younger sister. Deeply attached to her brother, she hated Yai and Sai for getting Itsuki locked up when he helped him escape. She now thinks Mio is Yai and attacks her. A delicate child, she always hid in the closet whenever outsiders came to the house to visit. When the repentance came, she hid in the closet to get away from the darkness. Too afraid to come out, she witnessed the entire massacre from inside. Chitose died in that closet. That is miserable. The remaining were those dolls. The twin that killed her other half in the Crimson Sacrifice ritual was called the remaining, was feared and respected. I think we knew about this. Some of these remainings went insane with grief, and others had their hair turn white overnight. Like Itsuki. Which means that Itsuki must have killed Mutsuki in the ritual before. Many of them turned reclusive and shunned all human contact. Twins are known to share each other's pain. The remaining bore a vestige in her own throat of the mark her sister received during the ritual. Remember, the doll twins, one of them strangled the other. And then, th remember, part of the ritual is throw them into the freaking hell gate. I'll cloth cover something. Huh. I have no idea what that is. Okay. Well, we're going back upstairs. And there's a stairway right nearby. I like that part. I'm going to wrap this up shortly, I think. There's not too much more to go. Uh, wait. I think we're finally done with that girl, so this is a good time to save. Normally I'd cut the installment here as it's about a half hour, but I know I'm near a checkpoint. Plus, we can finally get Mayu out, and I know you've been waiting for that, because her life sucks. Now, where is she exactly? No. No. Nah. Tachibana, staircase, hallway. Yeah, it is in here. Okay. This is it, right? No, 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 no. I'm doing it wrong. Here it is, here it is. It's right in front of me. It's a damn closet. Ah, oh, come I suck at this game. Raised to Tommy Room. Isn't she, like, right nearby? Wait, you hear that? Hey. She's back. I mean, she's different, but she's sort of back. It's the Broken Neck Woman. It's a different broken neck woman. Six thousand six hundred fifty-eight points, baby. Look at that. Her neck's all lopsided. What do you think's creepier, upside down one or this? Because both are pretty messed up. And don't forget, this one walks, which is creepy in its own right. And we're done. One more for the road. Regular shot. I was hoping we'd run into her. Now I want to go to Itsuki's room. Maybe it's in here? I don't even know where I'm... Yeah, it must be in there, because I couldn't get in there before. Right, let's get Mayu the hell out of here. I I'm sorry, my memory's really flaky here. Okay, I do go ahead. We're gonna do this right. The last time we got to her cell, she was somehow out and in this freaking house. This time, we're gonna get herself for real. No. Okay. Uh, 
Am I doing this right? I don't think I am. Hmm. Wasn't there a door? Right. Oh, to my left. Excuse me. Aha! You have got to be kidding me. Mayu, I swear to God. Also, the door's still locked. Keep that in mind. This better be goddamn good. Itsuki, I pray that you read this. I can't stay in this village any longer. I told Yai and Sai that I would come for them on the day of the ceremony. After they make it out of the village, I'll take care of them. Don't worry. When I get them out, I'll come back for you next. Ryozo Munakata. Bound Diary. If we perform the Crimson Sacrifice, then Yai and Sai will not need to go through the ritual. But if our ritual fails, they will be the only ones left for the next sacrifice. I have to get Yai and Sai out of this village. The horror has to stop. There has to be another way. I cannot let Yai and Sai suffer like this. The old passageway under Kureha Shrine has been sealed ever since some twins tried to escape through there long ago. The ceremony master said that they were killed by a cave-in during their escape. Concerned, the ceremony master sealed the old tree which enshrines the remaining. Okay, remember that shrine on the outside of the village under that Shinto gate? There's apparently an underground passage behind that. I investigated behind it before, but obviously it was locked back then. Also, the old tree! Remember that? That was also locked. Although the path is sealed, a passageway still leads out. Opening the seal should make it possible to leave the village. The pinwheel keys that open the seal have been handed down through the families of four veiled priests? Really? I have to fight four priests again? I was able to find the pinwheel for this family in the storehouse. There's your hint. After passing through a passageway, you only have to run through the forest and remember to never look back. But will those two have the willpower necessary? Okay. Storehouse. Crest. Good. So there's probably going to be an Osaka, Kiryu, and Kurosawa crest. Crap. Fluorite. Cutscene. Through here, we can get out of the village. Um Oh, I don't need this. I really don't need this. Oh, she's walking by? Just don't open the door, okay? She's not actually coming through, is she? Better freaking not. Uh uh I'm not prepared for this. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. That's creepy as hell. Mayu? You're not going to turn back and insta kill me, are you, Mayu? I don't know what's happening to me. But no matter what happens, I'll forgive you. Mayu? I'll forgive you? I'll forgive you? What? Okay, okay, okay. Okay, whatever you say. Of course I won't leave you behind. I kept looking for you. Now let's get out of here. Yes. Let's get the hell out. Ooh, sigh, you gave me a scare. Chapter 8. Half moon. You see that red gold in the background. It's beginning. Hurry. We need to get to the old tree. Good. And there's a save point, see? You like that? Also, fluorite. Uh, oh, and Myers charm. Let's do it. I don't want to be alone. Ugh. Ugh. Dark? And then we get whatever the hell Mayu has to say. I'm sorry. Because 
I ran away. Everyone had to die. Ugh. Wow, that's dark. And sorry to do this at such a time, but this is where I'm going to cut off the installment. Oh boy. That is oppressive. Chapter 8, The Half Moon. We're getting there, folks. We're getting toward Endgame. Not immediately. We still have a couple chapters to go, but we're getting there. Well, we certainly made a lot of progress today, didn't we? We took out the Crimson Kimono a good three more times until she finally dropped her items, and we don't have to put up with her again. Although she had a miserable past when she was alive. But she dropped the key to Mayu's cell, and now that we finally, finally got the key to Mayu's cell, she wasn't freaking there. But this time... She actually came back moments later, so it was all for the best. And now, we found a way out of the village. We have to go to the old tree. We need the pinwheel keys to open the passage to get us the hell out. The problem is, I get the feeling we're going to need a couple more crests. I get the feeling we might need to head back to each of the houses. Except, of course, for Tachibana. One more time, just to see if there's a crest in there. Maybe I'm wrong, but I don't know. I'm harboring a suspicion that the game is going to pull that little trick on us. Whatever the case, we might have a way out yet. Until next time, everyone.